when adversity hits, we all have a choice. Whether or not to quote unquote die or give up or to adapt and conquer and succeed. Those are your two options. Either you give up what you're doing or you keep pushing forward no matter what. Um, and right now, for my own personal life and for my own personal documentation, journaling, vlogging, uh, is my shoulder. I have chosen every single step to improve and to keep going and try to succeed. I know I've stated in previous videos that I will not let this injury stop me, but it does have on the other side and the effects of what I'm going through currently right now, which I don't think is anything like major in the grand scheme of things. This adversity isn't that bad. In the grand scheme of things, like this isn't that important like to the world per se, but I always like to record these things because right now, man, I am like just so mentally down not being able to train hard, like at all, since quarters has been eating me up. Being quote unquote injured for six, eight weeks now, like almost two months. The thing with my face that was going on at the beginning of the year, like I haven't had, and I don't say this out, out of like pity Josh. Oh, poor Josh. I'm saying this like, so you guys have context that like, everything you might see on social media for me might be great, but internally like this is like, what behind the scenes is happening and just to be like vulnerable and share that I think it's important but like right now man I do not like I don't like waking up I don't like going to work I don't like going to the gym I don't enjoy being home I still do the very very bare minimum basics that I need to get done but it eats me up inside ha because the shoulder thing is still there I'm behind on content I'm behind on training I have a big comp in three months that I value and I think is a, a great competition. I want to show out, man. Like, I'm trying to win. And this is impeding me from doing that. And I'm, I'm spending all my free time trying to figure out how to fix this thing. And I've done my due diligence to try to succeed. I haven't given up in saying, oh, I'm going to retire. I'm done. This sport has beaten me up. This is why you shouldn't weight lift. This is why you shouldn't do CrossFit. This is why you shouldn't train. Instead, I'm like, screw that. I'm going to fix this. I'm going to find out how to get this done. And every night I've researched areas of the muscle, muscle uh, blah, blah, blah. muscles of the shoulder, the ligaments, the joints, the nerves that run and figuring out what symptoms match up and how I can make adjustments and how I can fix those things. And hopefully today, and I have faith in my PT guy who is going to hopefully put some things back into place for my shoulder. Again, I don't think anything structurally is broken. There's no bones that are broken. It's all muscular. It's just a bunch of tightness. And we just need to undo that and fix and put things back, the pieces back together. And I have full faith and confidence. I've been praying about it, man. And that's the decision I have made in order to keep moving forward. I've also been going to the gym. I've had to modify my training a lot. A lot of legs, a lot of core. Not a whole lot of upper body, but just enough to kind of like wet my whistle and keep me alive and well um, physically speaking but I don't like training right now like I'm so upset that I can't go full tilt um, it just hurts to like right now this thing on my shoulder like it physically hurts me right now I'm holding you guys with my right hand I'm driving with my left it hurts like not to the point where I want to pass out but like it's like a good five six out of ten like I can feel it every time I breathe hurts if I laugh or cough or sneeze too hard hurts a lot. It feels like a straight up just like a uh, knife in the back. Um, laying down a certain way. I wake up in the middle of the night a couple times because I'm laying on it the wrong way and it's just excruciating. I'm just like, it's just achy. Um, but you know, we're going to keep persevering. Again, I'm not going to let this get me down to where I just give up on everything. I'm still executing. I'm still getting up, doing my best at work, doing my best at gym, do, do at the gym, doing my best at the apartment to help my wife. And then I just like kind of get a little like down on myself and then I just like pass out on the couch or pass out on the floor. Um, and that's mainly my day right now, unfortunately. But you know, you go through ebbs and flows, ups and downs, and I'm here to weather, weather the storm, get out of the valley um, and start climbing. Seeing clearer, sunnier days. I think this summer is gonna be a good one. Just gotta get a little healthier first and then start doing the things that I enjoy again. So, hope that's the case. I'm praying that's the case. 
for everyone that's sticking around watching these. I want to say thank you guys for watching another episode. And as always, peace. Much love.